Welcome back to part two of the boat build, everyone. So uh, we're gonna get right into it. Got the four-wheeler hooked up. I'm gonna get the boat pulled out and uh, start working on the back deck here. I did get a few more parts in, so I'll show you that. And uh, yeah, we'll get working here. Here are a few things that came in. Uh, we got a couple black uh, drink holders, these stand up rod holders, three of them here. These are going to be for the side rod locker. Uh, again, hold three rods. And a couple flush mount um, handles for the deck. And I'm going to need one more now that I'm doing three hatches. So have to get one more of these ordered up. And uh, yeah, just wanted to show you a few things that came in. I traced out my half of the back deck. So I'm going to have to do this one in two pieces. Trace it onto my uh, plywood here, and I'm going to cut it out. That should be one half, and then uh, I'm hoping I have enough room on this sheet of plywood to do the second half. It's looking like it, so we'll get these cut out, and we'll show you how they fit. Okay, so we're finally getting somewhere. We got a front and back deck on. That's how this one's looking. So, again, not perfect. Some of the corners a little wee bit off, but all in all, once that's carpeted, it's gonna look really good. There's the front deck still, still not uh, carpeted, but we'll get that done once this one's done. We're gonna do them all at the same time. So yeah, that's how it's looking so far. So, uh, yeah, next step is to get these hatches cut out in the back, and I'm gonna be putting a support in right under here. But it sits on this back ledge and sits all on the seat. So once this is uh, screwed down, it's not gonna go anywhere, it's solid. So that's the next uh, step, get those cut out, and uh, we'll show you uh, how it looks after that. So that's the gas tank that's gonna be going on this side of the boat under this hatch. So I just marked out the edges here. So I know this supports there and the edge of the seat is here. So it's still gonna fit pretty well. Thinking I'm gonna cut it here and that's gonna be my hatch. And uh, that'll fit well. So I just wanna make sure that would fit. And then on the other side, I think I'm gonna do a little smaller one just for a fit a bait bucket in there or even dry storage. So that's gonna be the plan for that. We'll get it cut out and we'll show you how it looks. So as you can see, we got the two back hatches cut. The front deck's almost done, it's really coming along. I can't wait to get this carpeted, it's gonna look pretty good. There's the back two hatches. I actually made this one a little bit bigger because my gas tank's gonna be in that one. So uh, yeah, that's how it looks. Um, yeah, not too bad. So I'm going to cut out a couple lids for these, get the 2x4s run for them, for the supports. And uh, yeah, that's my next step here. Let's get working. The hatches are cut, and uh, yeah, the casting deck is pretty much done front and back. Um, I think it's looking pretty good. We got a one inch hole here for my, or one and a half inch hole there for my gas line to go through and a one and a half inch hole there for my fish finder wires to run through. But uh, yeah, it's looking pretty good. We are done for the day. Got a lot of progress done. We got the front and back casting de decks all cut and fitted. So uh, the next step's gonna be carpeting them. So uh, tune in for part three where we do that. Thanks for watching.